Cherry Griffiths to break. Paul Cliff Thorburn, four. Well, that's one way of getting them, I suppose, and staying on the black as well. My word, that's a bonus. Seven. what a lovely fluke that was that Cliff Thorburn got because these reds are now spread open beautifully. Nine. I couldn't possibly wish to have the balls in a better position than this.
Well, Cliff has gone through a little bit too far on that shot. I think I think the red may go into the centre pocket. Perfect angle on the black here. Well, Cliff didn't uh, get into that one as he wanted to, wanted to hold the cue ball on the other reds and he's just slipped out of position a little bit now you can clip this one in and come around the back of the black but uh, not quite as nice as it should have been I think it was a little bit fortunate there after getting out of position to have such a easy shot to just drop it onto the black again. Gradually finding it a little more difficult. Again, he's got a red here on the left hand corner pocket. And that's a good shot. A soft screw there just to hold him on the black. I think he can see the black. And there's a nice picture of the Thorburn stance, very square to the table. misfortune there with that fluke by Cliff at the start of this uh, break. Oh, that's a nice shot. Well, this will be the eighth black. Cliff's uh, main objective will be to win the frame, but he'll certainly be looking for a very big break here.
you feel very much happier when the frame is actually safe and to do that he needs another two reds and then he can relax and concentrate on making a very big break because there is a marvelous opportunity here yes there's also a marvelous prize uh, Rex some three thousand pounds for the uh, highest break and that's worth a night out Well, Cliff will be looking for something better than just the highest break here, Jack, because he's still taking all blacks and £10,000 for maximum break and for a new championship record of one four six five thousand pounds Well, I'm going to break a rule here, Rex. Every time we talk about these wonderful breaks, they go and break down, so I'm going to let him finish this break. I'm a wee bit superstitious. Well, this next one will be the tenth black. And the adrenaline will be really flowing with uh, Cliff at the moment because he knows that this is the type of opportunity that doesn't crop up very often. And still perfect position to just get the red nearest to the black and back onto the black again. Hasn't quite stunned that as much as he wanted to. Left himself a little bit finer angle on the black than he wanted. He'll get position on the red without any problem, but it just made the black a little bit more difficult. And Griffiths, quite aware that he's lost the frame now, I am sure that he is hoping and praying that uh, Cliff Thorburn will do this. Ninety-seven. Well, Cliff this time uh, needs to get round the back of those uh, reds to leave himself a choice of either red into the corner or red into the centre. Well, now it's got to get on this uh, red in such a way to get back on the black. So now this is Have a, little break here. a difficult <laughs> 
Well, what a, what a sensible fellow. At a stage like this with just one red left, he stops and blows his nose and says, let's have a break. And if he can take this red and the black, the colours will be on their spots. Oh, and what a moment this is. It is truly electric here. If only we could tell the audience not to applaud just for the remainder of this break. stop playing on the other table well now this is the real shot uh, that matters Jack to get on the yellow if he can do that he could be well on He hasn't come quite far enough. He's left himself a tough shot, but that's 15 reds and 15 blacks that he's taken now. Well, this is carrying £10,000 for the highest break, 5000 for a championship break, and 3000 for the highest break. So we're talking about £18,000 on this. Well, that was a marvellous yellow that uh, Cliff Thorburn took then. And Bill Werbenick, as tense as he is. Perfect. Well, I don't think there's going to be another moment in Cliff's life when he's going to be so tense as this. Maybe he's deciding. He's 5-2 down. He's going to pinch a few quid. <laughs> 